Hi guys, Tech Creator here, and in this tutorial, I'll be showing you how you can create flash effect using Sony Vegas. Now, there are many ways of doing this, but I'll be showing you the three simple way of creating this flash effect. Uh, so, without further ado, let's get to the tutorial. But before we begin making the flash effect, I'll be showing you an example of um, what I'm talking about and what is the flash effect and what we are going to be creating. So, let's play this video. As you can see guys, there's like nice flash effect going on in the video and uh, today I'll be teaching you how you can make that using Sony Vegas. So let's get started. Let's close this video down. Open up, sorry not that, open up Sony Vegas and uh, drag in your file that you want to work on. And once you dragged in, right click properties. You don't have to do this but this is something that I do, you know, keeps the video quality good once you imported your files then uh, the first method of doing creating the flash is really 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 simple uh, all you have to do is uh, for what wherever you want your flash to appear on the timeline just press s to split the clip and uh, simply just go to transition and go go to flash and drag in default here to middle of the split and then close this window down uh, you can see it created this um, I don't know how can you explain this but this square thingy here uh, depending on uh, your need if you want your flash to be really really uh, long like slow flash then it's fine but if you want to make like a hard flash like you want it to be quick like one second then you can just simply hold and drag down this box to uh, near the sp your split line so from both sides I'll be like dragging in as you can see it the square the flash square or rectangle part is uh, small now and this will give you this will uh, incre increase the time of the flash and it will make it uh, faster so as you can see uh, it was before it was slow and now once I shorten it up uh, it's flat fast now and you can keep shortening it if you want more fast faster you know like like that so yeah that's the first way of creating the flash effect simple and now I'll be showing you the second way of creating the flash effect to create the flash the second way all you have to do is press Control, left shift and B on your timeline and this will open up this little tab on the bottom it says video and all you have to do is right click on it and go to insert slash remove um, envelope and then head down to fade to color and I don't know if you can see this but it gave like a long red line in the middle of the tab so let's say if I want to create a flash uh, from here sorry from here to here all I have to do is zoom in and double click on the uh, red line like one frame before the flash starts and this will create a little uh, square box and then create another square box right next to it now you'll go to the end of the flash time so let's say if I want to again if I want to create a flash like flash from here to here then I'll go to end of the uh, timeline then create another square uh, double click and to create another square box and I'll be creating another square box right side of it again and once you're done this it will give you four square box and again you'll go uh, you will go back to uh, the middle of your flash timeline so again I'll be creating from here to here so I'll be going in the center I click on the center then I can just simply uh, drag this all the way to up or down depending on what you need what you need so uh, if I put it all the way up it will be brighter and if I put it a bit down it will be uh, a bit dim uh, now if I play that play this video as you can see this gave me another flash effect so the first one was this and the second one was this again uh, 
uh, the same principle applies for this one as well so you can just drag this left and play around with it depending on if you want the flash to be a hard flash or soft flash so if I like make this wider then the flash is going to be smaller I mean slower okay that's the second way of doing it and I'll be showing you the third way of doing it the third way to create the flash effect the third way all you have to do is simply create another video track and drag the video track all the way to the, to the top and once it's on the top and let's say I want to create my flash effect right here uh, all you have to do is head over to media generator and then go to solid color and there are a variety of colors that, that you can choose from orange red green so you can have like different color flashes but white white colors are most common flashes that I use on video editing so I'll be using white for this tutorial just drag this and drop it on the track that you created close it down it will turn your screen to white don't worry uh, as you can see it will give like a white solid color and the timeline gonna be here all you have to do is trim left click and trim the solid color down to nearest near your flash point uh, from both sides and once you've done that then simply click on this uh, shape here and it says opacity and um, drag this down depending on your need again if you if you if you want it to be really 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 wide then you can drag it all the way up if you want to be like see-through or like a little bit wide but you still can see the clip then keep, keep in the 50 60 65 percent I would say but just mess around with it and uh, they'll then fade this in a bit again this will give you another flash effect oops yep this will give you another flash effect so yeah that's the third method of doing it again first second third uh, I hope this tutorial helps you guys I know that my instruction wasn't that clear but I tried my best so if this video does help you then thumbs up comment and subscribe uh, if you have any suggestion on future videos then do leave a comment and I'll be making a video about that thanks for watching see you guys